everyone. You're here with Dr. Python JavaScript, also known as Black JavaScript. And I'm going to show you guys how to get 10K views on YouTube. So I've had a YouTube channel for a little while now. Come to my channel. I have 15 subscribers. Here are my videos. They're doing okay. All right. Nothing awesome there. But we see someone who's got some consistency and really wants to teach people a thing or two about computer science. And I also want an archive of a lot of the things that I've been working on. Ten years, I'll look back at this and I'll be happy. But anyways, so I got this comment and, you know, this person seems to be really happy. Uh, they were searching six hours to find a solution and they found my video and even though the solution happened to be simple, it really saved them more senseless streaming of Google, which can lead you down a dark, dark path. But, um, so yeah, I'm seeing that awesome. But then, you know, if we go to this video, uh, which has the most video uh, views out of all of my videos, I see that this person left a similar comment. Thank you so much, dude, for this video. I was facing the same issue, but then I realized I didn't save my file. Thank you. Now, this video is 34 minutes because I literally recorded me debugging this problem. And at the end, I have this like aha moment where I'm like, holy shit, this was my fucking mistake. This part is funny. I'm actually going to record it. It's funny. So I spend like 30 minutes, you know, trying to figure out what the hell is going on. Right. And I'm going through directories. I'm trying to find things online and people are writing all this bullshit. And I'm just like, what, what is going on here? So at this point, I'm trying to see everything that I've installed in my, uh, with pip, right? And I do see the fast API. I do see the UV corn, but I'm just going crazy. I'm like, all right, maybe it's not UV corn standard. But then. I'm looking at the file and I'm just like, hmm, what's going on here? Then it hits me like a rock. See, that would be hilarious. That's what the problem was. Literally, I usually have autosave, but in this situation, I didn't. Now that I saved it, Also, make sure I had auto save on this time. Because okay, so it literally might just be that I didn't save. So if I say UV corn, yep. Mean, yep. App, yep. Dash dash. Reload. Wow. And fucking save. Now the application worked. Well, you guys are about to be in for a treat because now we can actually go to our API. So now I go to the application. Now you guys can go ahead and slash down. I'll write the whole thing out. So here I'm accessing my route. And you will say slash slash localhost colon. And it tells us that the port will be clear. Is going to Okay. So, we'll say 8, so I put the port in, and now we have our object, and we can go ahead and hit. Here's a response. Slash, slash docs. And look at our automated documentation. Love it. 
follow our dependencies here. Okay, so that was nuts. But anyways, I hope this gets 10k views because all the resources online useless for this simple error, which may have been my fault. But I think a lot of people will run into the same problem. Anyways, I hope you like and subscribe to this.